In this video, I'm going to show you how this one product Shopify dropshipping store was able to scale to more than $50,000 per month with a very clever strategy that nobody out there is teaching or doing. I think it was amazing when I saw their ads. I was like, this is what they're doing. We've done it before and it works amazingly well. You can model after it, start doing it with your shop, scale your store and replicate the results. Let's find out. Hey, it's Rafael Centron here. By the end of this video, you're gonna know a clever strategy to scale your store. If you also wanna get into one product dropshipping or eventually scale with one product dropshipping, I'm gonna teach you as well how to do it in this video. But before we start, I want to remind you that I'm doing a full store giveaway, a complete Shopify store ready to start getting sales. I'm picking the winner in the next couple of days. This is your last chance. Comment, automate automate down in the comments below comment automate we teach people how to automate their shopify business subscribe hit that notification bell and that like button if you like to enter this giveaway i'm picking somebody in the next few days also i'm happy to announce that the free one-on-one call for my automated dropshipping program my flagship program that has taken students from zero all the way up to 100,000 per month is open free one-on-one calls if you're interested watch until the end of the video for the details all right so this is the store right here it's called soothing bed and it's just basically this pet bed i've talked a lot about this product the many different angles that there are to this particular product. It's a little dog bed right here. You can see it really cute, $25 per product right here. And a lot of people have been trying to sell this product in their Shopify stores again and again and again. I've seen it. I've seen so many ads for this particular product and not that many people can make it profitable. This particular store is a one product store. If you click anywhere in the store, it's just gonna take you to this page. So this is one product page. The cool thing that they have on their particular product page is that they have the example breeds. I haven't seen that many people do this. They break it down into the breeds. If you have a particular breed, you can just go to the size, pick the size, boom, buy it very quickly. So they're really understanding the audience that they're targeting to and then selling them a product that really fits the particular dog that they're selling or that they're targeting to. Then you have the description here, some customer reviews on the bottom, just a straightforward Shopify store here, just a one product store. Also says a scene on Buzzfeed, Modern Dog and so on. And to show you how much they're actually making, I'm trying to use sales source here to calculate the revenue, but actually sales source hasn't been pulling up. I've been trying it for the past couple of hours and it's not pulling up this particular store. So I'm gonna show you another way to calculate the revenue from a Shopify store or at least estimate the revenue that a Shopify store is making. As you can see, it's not loading. Here you can see that it says, there was an error analyzing the store. Please try again. As much as I try, I can't. So there's another way that you can do it is for example, if you go to a massive, massive dropshipping store like Blue Crate, if you go to this little Chrome extension here, it's called Similar Web. Similar Web basically tells you the traffic of a website, how much traffic a website gets every single week or month. And this particular one is getting 100,000, 76,000, 89,000, 91,000, 100,000. So it's averaging around 100,000 visits per month. If we go to this other app called Pexla, so sorry that I clicked there, it's this little Chrome extension here on the top, it's called Pexla, it basically tells you the exact same thing. So it tells you how many visits the store has every single month and the countries that it's getting from, the Facebook pages that it has and so on. Blue Crate is making more than a million dollars per month. So that is a 10X on their traffic. So they get a traffic of 107,000 per month, then they make a million dollars per month. This usually isn't typical for every Shopify store out there. So what I like to do is I like to take this number from Pexla and I like to double it. That is more of a reasonable revenue estimation. So if Blue Crate is having 107,000 per month, then you can estimate that they're getting $200,000 per month in revenue. So in this particular store, the soothing bed, if you click on Pexla, it pulls up 29,000 per month from the United States and Canada. It's also important to look at the countries. If the first country is not the United States or a high, prof a high profile country or a high earning country or a country that typically buys, then it typically isn't making that much money. I've seen some stores that just say top country, China, it probably isn't making that much money. This particular one, 29,000, we doubled that to 60,000. So the store is actually making 60, 
thousand dollars per month with this bed alone now for the ad strategy which is what you're here for let's go to their ads library and click united states here you can see the page has four thousand likes started a couple months ago so only in august they actually started so not that long ago if you look at their ads they're pretty standard just a video black friday sale get yours now at 60 percent off so it doesn't talk too much until i saw these ads like the woman in the thumbnail with the dog and i was like okay let me check this out and then let's click that I just received this anti-anxiety bed from soothingbed.com um my dog here chico usually has very bad anxiety uh he's usually very jumpy uh hates noises and trembles but took two days to receive this since we ordered it and he practically hasn't left it it's very soft and cuddly um so quality is spot on size is perfect he feels like he's just being cuddled as you can see he's very very so look at that video ad they're not making it fancy the quality is actually not that great at all and on the top the ad copy says we let our bed do the talking our beds have helped change thousands of dogs lives with a testimonial video i barely see people doing testimonial videos they do it again and again and again they do it here then they do it on the bottom I recently bought an anti-anxiety bed from soothingbeds.com. As soon as Bully saw this bed, he jumped right on it, started rolling around, and he pretty much has not left it ever since. The reason we wanted to get it was because he was getting really bad anxiety at night, I think because of the loud sounds um, going on outside, which made him a little bit jumpy. Often find him lying on the floor instead of his uh, beds. Uh, but ever since we got these, he's been able to actually calmly sleep for the whole night, which has been awesome. And the testimonial is scripted in a way where they first say, I got this bed from soothingbed.com. They, they see the real website there, so they know that there's a connection to the website. Then she says, I got this bed because my dog is very anxious. My dog is very jumpy. There's a lot of noise outside. And I got the bed to get rid of that jumpiness, of that anxiety that my dog has. And they're using those testimonials again and again and again on their ads. They're basically letting their customers or maybe not their customers, maybe an influencer talk for them and even in the, in the ad copy they say we let our bed do the talking they don't even have to sell to you because the bed is so good they're focusing on the product so much that people are loving the product and it's an amazing product to sell and it's an amazing product for you to buy because somebody just like you bought the product they loved it their dog loves it and so on i barely see anybody using testimonial videos we use them a lot and we use them for our brands we basically get somebody an influencer it can be somebody on instagram maybe somebody on youtube maybe one of your customers even if you already have a lot of sales you can get them to do a video pay them 75 maybe 100 dollars for this particular video with your product say that the product is from your store say why they bought it why that person that's watching that video should buy it and that really can that's that's a really the best way to sell the best way to sell a product is by showing somebody like you had an amazing experience with the product bought the product from that store and now is happy that they bought it as you can see their faces pop up again and again here two testimonials testimonial 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 all their ads are basically testimonials they're doing both ad copies like we let our bed do the talking as well as get yours now highly highly recommend you do this if you have a store for example right now maybe a general store or a niche store and you're selling let's say one of the products that i gave out last week if you want to find out that list of products check that link in the description let's say it's this food sealer or these ski skates what you can do is test it in your store if it does well then you can create a whole one product store for it just like soothing bed did and really understand your audience this is something that nobody talks about and it's massively important if you want to sell products you need to understand your audience there understanding what size they need because of the breed then they're talking more about what the product does why you should buy it why the person should even bother getting this product and then they show you testimonial videos that are super impactful in getting that buying process so what i would do take this product test it if it does well i create a one product store for it then i get a lot of influencers to do me videos and do presentations with the product maybe i get one of my own customers and i send them a product for free or i get an influencer that's small maybe they have five thousand 
10,000 subscribers on Instagram. I send them the product for free. I have them do the video, mention my brand, talk about my brand, talk about why they should get it, why they got it, how fast was the shipping, every single thing, the quality, everything. And then I put that on my ads again and again and again. We do that a lot. We do that especially with YouTube ads, Facebook ads, every single network of traffic testimonials and customer result, customer review videos are best, best way and the best type of ad that you can create ever for your dropshipping store. Get your one product dropshipping journey started and take your product to the next level with testimonial videos. If you're interested in working with me in my automated dropshipping program, my flagship program that teaches you how to take your business from zero all the way up to 50,000 per month, automate it so you don't have to work on it more than two hours per day. Make sure to schedule a strategy call in the second link in the description. You're going to see it down below. Automated dropshipping program call. It is a free session, but only schedule if you're serious about taking your business to the next level and are really invested into the success of your business. We're going to help you. And just like we do with our students, take you to hundred thousand per month or more. Schedule your free strategy call. And if you want to learn the top 20 products to sell in 2020 that you can drop ship right now. Make sure to check the video right there. Click the first link in the description, top 20 products for 2020. Make sure to comment, automate, subscribe, hit that notification bell for a free giveaway. Schedule a strategy call with us. Take your business to the next level. Like the video if you liked it, and I will see you on the next one. Happy New Year 2020.